It's a long journey. Today, 483rd story on Zen, a small discussion with you. In whatever manner you understand, that is the truth. You do not have to interpret whether what you heard or listened from me, whether you have to open a particular dictionary. No, 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 no dictionary is needed. Each one has got a different style, talent. On that talent, your, your understanding and putting it into practice is the truth and growth. The Zen story, learning to be silent. The pupils of the Tendai school used to study meditation before Zen entered Japan. Four of them were intimate friends, promised one another to observe seven days of silence. On the first day, all was silent. The meditation had begun auspiciously, but when night came and the oil lamps were growing dim, one of the pupils could not help exclaiming to a servant, Fix those lamps. The second pupil was surprised to hear the first one talk. We are not supposed to say a word, he remarked. You two are stupid. Why did you talk? asked the third. I am the only one who has not talked, concluded the fourth pupil. Silence. In India it is understood and it has been exported around the world as meditation. Because India has taught the world in silence, you can see the truth and the Western world understood the truth is to grab the materialistic world. Yes, that is also truth. You have a gun, either you can keep shooting at the people and you will be taken to the jail. Or you can keep it as a stitch in time saves. Nine, you have a kitchen knife, either you can use it for cutting the vegetables or you can take the knife and go around the city and start threatening people. That's different. The silence. The silence is to not to grab another person. Yes, in silence you can see the other person. You can understand the other world also. Your truth is such is so beautiful. Hence, people have misunderstood silence. And they all went into meditation, meditating. And uh, the people who have gone for meditation are the person, people who have spoken too much. And one of the person is the Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal. Look at him. People are meditating. Yes. I think Rahul Gandhi also. Yes. All these people are going to meditation class to come out. That is suppressed talk. That is not silence that they have understood. In that silence they were talking. And in the talking they were trying to find out whom to dig, how to dig. Yes. That is called, that was called the monkey business, interfering in the other person's matters. In that silence, which you have not understood the depth of your silence, if you have understood the depth of the silence, then you can see only yours. And yours is the most beautiful part because there is so much to learn from yours. Once you, you learn so much of yours and you start polishing your every part of your body, physical body and understanding the mental strength, you knew your value. Once that value has come, the world has enjoyed that value because your strength was the strength of so many who were unconscious. So many who have not been able to concentrate. So many who have not been able to observe. People who are walking like dead bodies start looking up at people who have been understood, who has understood the silence. Not that blabbering silence which you have understood 
it's called suppressed silence you understood a particular you have seen the smoke but you have not seen the fires the pupils of the tentai school used to study meditation before zen entered japan like any other people who studies before zen entered japan and before they could understand themselves people so pupils of the tentai school used to study meditation means they used to study like our children study primary high school university and then they go for professional courses same same they the school used to study medit before zen entered before zen entered japan they used to study meditation means to understand yourself but here once that materialistic world has entered into the schools and colleges everything is smoke and not fire from the smoke you you think you have understood the whole world and to become a slave to so many people and that's where your physical disability started coming medicines pharmaceutical companies started making money using you misusing you the people of the tentai school used to study me before zen and four of them who are intimate friend friends promised one and another to observe seven days of silence seven days let us understand the value of our hands legs mouth eyes ears nose and our heart that silence so that we can understand our wife our husband our children uh, the, so that we can under, let us observe silence means let us try to look observe our family what is the strength of each family each one is a powerful each one is a thousand men warrior it's a diamond why can't we try to uh, share it up and use it and not talk about monkey business that was what it is seven days of so seven days of silence on the first day all was silent yes everybody tried to look at understand each other the meditation had become auspiciously but when one night came and the oil lamps were growing dim one of the people could not help exclaiming to a servant fix those lamps chanchala the mind starts wavering he wanted to have the monkey business he started looking and he found out the lamp went out uh, what is that got to do with your lamp you have a light in say fix those lamps the uh, one dim lamps are growing dim only dim it has not gone out and you want to light it up he forgot that the light is in self be a light unto yourself you don't look at the others the other lamp which is dim your light is powerfully working burning use that burning to convert that gold into beautiful ornaments you and your wife and your husband your children and the family and the joint family and the family tree that burning is that silence of meditation which our intent gurus and our temples have forgotten to mention really they took it in indirect method indirect method like krishna always talking indirect always talking and nobody in the whole world understand what krishna is talking so many people gurus have talk, spoken indirectly the second people are surprised to hear the first one talk we are not supposed to say a word he remarked again he also opened the mouth yes he also broke from the understanding the truth because all that glitters is not that gold boy even if it is said that glitters was really gold glitters was more tasty our food in the house is not tasty but we must go to kentucky fried chicken to mcdonald's and pizza hut and we must spend our money to eat the rubbish thing from who made a where made from where it come with the cockroaches the rats have gone and jumped and danced and put number 1 number 2 is not relevant but we must go because we are our mind is attracted to the colors and the advertisement you two are stupid why did you talk us the third i am the only one who has not talked conclude the fourth 